Hello everybody, my name is Nathan Sifu, and welcome to Mass Effect 3. Let's play. Commander, something on your mind? Uh... Let's see, the, let's say the re Reaper progress. What's the Reaper situation? It's not trending well, even if you did buy Radix some time. Our threat projections show the Reapers will gain the advantage on most other fronts. And now the Asari are a prime target. They're the most advanced race in the galaxy. We'll soon find out if that means anything. Yeah, that's what If I, I may, mean. Admiral, I have a personal question. Speak freely, Commander. Why me? Why put me in charge of all this? Because you're the only son of a bitch I've got who knows how to kill Reapers. Hmm. Anyone can. You just have to be smart and hope you get lucky. Anyone can figure it out. Your dossier says otherwise, Shepard. You stopped the Batarian slavers on Elysium all those years ago. What you did, the people who survived that ordeal still thank you by name. And because of that, you think I qualify to save the galaxy? Shepard, let me tell you something that I've learned the hard way. You can pay a soldier to fire a gun. You can pay him to charge the enemy and take a hill. But you can't pay him to believe. I don't follow, sir. When you went up against Sovereign, there was no good reason to believe you'd win. But your crew didn't seem to care. They went along anyway. Your trip through the Omega-4 relay? That was a suicide mission, if there ever was one. Yet there your crew was, standing beside you, proud to serve. Why? Because they believed in you, their leader. That's what I need now. Where we're taking them is liable to get pretty hairy, and I know you're the one who will get us to the other side. Hmm. Nice. What's our state of readiness, Admiral? We're getting there. And with the Reapers pressing their advantage across all fronts, we don't have a lot of time to catch up. What about the extra help we picked up along the way? Bringing in both the Quarians and the Geth has helped us immeasurably. The Quarian fleet is providing evac and fire support while the Geth attack Reaper supply lines. Oh, wow. Just a bunch of things opened up. Uh, the Rachni. What about the Rachni? I wouldn't have believed it, but the Rachni are helping us build the Crucible. You're kidding. Turns out they have a knack for weapons of mass destruction. In hindsight, I guess they'd know a thing or two about waging a galactic war. No problems with them, then? Other than scaring the hell out of our engineers, no. Not a lot of small talk going on there. <laughs> what about Arya's mercenaries? Arya Talok, there's someone I never thought we'd be in bed with. The blood pack will be useful and violent. Mostly Vorcha, I hear. Don't want to know how you got Arya's cooperation, but whatever you did, it was worth it. What about the Turians and Krogan? The Krogan and Turians have obviously been a big help. Erdnot Rex running the show is a bonus for us. And that female Krogan you rescued is rallying more support from the other clans. I'm glad you disabled that bomb on Tachunka. We could have lost a lot of Krogan support. As it is, we picked up some Turian troops. Good to hear. Uh, okay, and then this one. How about the Asari and Salarians? Since the coup attempt, the Asari have stepped up to the plate. They're committing fleets and sending a science team to work on the Crucible. Nice. And the Salarians? They sent the entire fleet as a thank you for rescuing their counselor. Plus, she seems to like you for getting her that job that got us the STG task force. I guess they managed to overlook the genophage cure. Oh, good. Uh, okay, I think then I have asked everything. I've asked about allied forces, reaper progress, collective readiness, why pick me. Uh, yeah, that's everything. Nothing more, sir. Hack it out. Cool. Nice. Um, all right. I would definitely like to do some more, um, more big missions tonight. But I think before I do that, I'll talk to the crew and I'll do a little bit of, um, I'll do a little bit of, uh, I guess tidying up, I guess you'd say, of some of the little, the littler bits. I'm trying to think of it. I think I'm supposed to hear it from Miranda at some point. I still haven't heard from her. Nice, so Geth have just been added to the first... Right, huh. The Quarian fleet is worth more. Isn't that interesting? Huh. 
All right, so let's, uh, yeah, we just did a big major mission. Let's talk to everybody. Did you meet Miranda on the Citadel? Um, no, strangely, that has not happened yet. Um, I don't know why. I know she's supposed to first talk to you in, like, in that, um, that specter room uh, on the hologram, but yeah. So maybe that's waiting for me now. Unread messages at your private terminal, Commander. Okay, we'll do Actually, trainer. I hear you are on the ground with the Reaper. He fired up at us a few times. Joker pulled the Normandy through some insane maneuvers to stay out of the line of fire. It's hard being in a fight like that, especially when you're not the one flying the ship. Joker's one of the best, though. At first I was nauseous, swinging around in my safety harness. But then I was furious, just <coughs> enraged. I wanted that thing dead. You didn't want the Reapers dead when they attacked Earth? I wanted them defeated. I wanted Earth saved. But I never wanted to physically tear them in half and watch them blow up. Congratulations, trainer. I believe you've discovered your fight-or-flight instinct. Perhaps I should have stayed with Chess. Although now I think I'm spoiled by the lack of explosions. Hmm. Okay, what do we got at the terminal? Uh, let's talk Korean War. Diana Alders. Uh, it may be hard to believe that uh, I believe after what we just went through, uh, but the rest of the galaxy is barely aware the Koreans ever went into the Vale, let alone started a war with the Geth. We're set. Uh, we're setting on a major piece of history here. Or, or, sorry, we're sitting on a major piece of history here. I have uh, material from all the uh, players except you. Can I get uh, into your cabin uh, for an hour and get uh, thoughts on a vid? Sure. Progress report. Uh, Shira v Vasranok. Commander. With assistance from the Geth, our fleet is nearly back to full strength. We have focused most of our efforts on providing evacuation assistant, uh, uh, assistance and support for the Turian fleet. While the Geth harassed the Reapers, uh, let's see, even with uh, our newfound peace, it seems foolish to risk uh, an incident by putting our forces in close proximity. Uh, I understand uh, from Admiral uh, Zen that the Crucible Project continues well through uh, uh, sorry, continues well through Zen herself seems uh, dissatisfied with technology uh, technological capability device um, though eccentric uh, she is also brilliant hopefully she will find some way to improve its functionality uh, I would never uh, I would never have believed you uh, would talk hand down commander uh, take care of uh, Tali Zora for me. Kila Salai. And then from Ta oh, from Tally. Uh, Shepard, just wanted uh, to let you know that I'm going to join Adams in engineering. It seems like the best place uh, for me to help, as long as I'm uh, coming with you anyway. Mm -hmm. Please drop by any time you have a minute. Sure. And then what's that? Um, uh, it's great that there are more people in the chat. Uh, I'll try to come back every now and then. Uh, cool, cool. Th uh, thanks, uh, 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 Tribble. What's that? Status update three four uh, uh, point two zero R uh, from invalid extra extranet domain. Geth programs uh, in hardware designation. Legion uh, have requested Prime runtimes update. Shepard, Commander, on platform status, complying. Prime Platforms housing in server 02241-14511. Remain stationed on Rannoch. Crater forces prevent transfer of Prime uh, Platforms to Geth transport vehicles. Uh, uh, cessation of Geth Creator conflicts require to assist to command, uh, Shepard, Commander, uh, designated allies, awaiting st uh, conflict status update. So that's what an email from a robot is like. What's it? Uh, from the wiki, uh, uh, oh, should Miranda not uh, spoke, uh, be spoken to before uh, Cerberus attack on the Citadel? Miranda will send uh, Shepard a message. 
to contact or via communications console in the Spectre office in the Citadel embassies. Okay, so it seems like I should be able to just go there yeah, and the talk Koreans to her. Yeah, the Koreans have done pretty well with those suits. Maybe they can make something like that for you. Yeah, they have. Protective medical exoskeleton. I could even get one with racing stripes. So what's the problem? Well, it's like walking around in heavy armor. It totally screws with my spatial awareness. I wear heavy armor, and my spatial awareness is perfect. Uh, you crashed the last shuttle you flew, Vega. I need to feel my balance shift when I'm flying. I need to feel the ship moving with me. You take that away, I don't know. I mean, I'm good, but I'm not me. Yeah, I get that. Plus, have you seen Tally? Come on, I don't have the hips to carry a suit like that. <laughs> Gotta hand it to you, Commander. That's the first time I've seen someone end a war by yelling. I'm glad it worked. I hope that if Tally could see reason, then the rest of the Quarians might listen too. I had hoped my cooperation with Tally, along with Legions, would help her question her socialized prejudice. Yeah, kind of hard to dehumanize someone who's right there guarding your back. And now we've got two fleets for the price of one. We didn't lose anybody. Except Legion, before it sacrificed itself. Oh. Legion referred to itself as I instead of we. Yeah, so? The singular pronoun indicates Legion's independent personality had fully actualized. In its last moments, it was not an avatar of the Get Consensus. It was a person. That's what I figured. Well, when the Get Fleet helps us retake Earth, I guess we'll owe that to him. So that bothered her. What's on your mind, Edie? I was just reflecting. The Quarian's historical era was not making the Geth enough like them. I'm not sure I understand. Units with networked intelligences will trend toward cooperation for mutual benefit. But units with central heuristics establishing an individual personality, such as myself, develop preferences. These preferences form attachments that keep my calculations from devaluing the worth of the lives aboard the Normandy. You're saying the Geth turned on the Quarians because they aren't individuals? That is my theory. But it is limited to a sample size of one society. The only other notable synthetic society is the Reapers, and we do not know if they govern by consensus as the Geth do. Do me a favor. Don't ask them. Mm. Hello, Shepard. Commander. Okay, so that's everything from them. Okay. What's that? Uh, not sure where you're at overall. Um, yeah, I, I'm fairly far into the game, so I'm thinking, like... I I probably couldn't end it tonight. Actually, actually no. I I know with absolute certainty I couldn't end it tonight, especially if I plan on doing all the DLC, which I do. Um, yeah, I think maybe three or four, maybe five more s streams, and I could finish this off. So that's what I would like to do. But uh, I would like to do one at least one more big mission tonight. Um, and I think that would probably put me at a good place in terms of progress. Oh, the, um, just trying to think. Uh, after, after I, after I talk to the crew, I'll see what, uh, I'll see what's left in my objectives. Whoops. I know we got a bunch of mopping up to do on the Citadel. Impressed you got those two groups together. We'll see how long the peace lasts. Commander? Commander? Yeah, it'd be nice to actually talk to you, Ashley. It's been, it's been fucking since Mass Effect 1, and that's... Ugh, whatever. Let's see. That's all. Okay. And nobody in here. Nobody, nobody. Okay. Let's see. Ashley, Dr. Shock was... Uh, Okay, so it's just Garrus and Liara. Okay, let's talk to Liara first. She's probably worried about the... about her home world. Another Reaper gone, and peace between the Geth and Quarians. It's amazing. And now my people have a world to fight for. Something they know will last forever. So long as you and the Geth remain good neighbors. They're not our servants anymore. I'm not sure what we should call them. Allies? Friends? There's still too many wounds on either side. But maybe one day. 
What's that? Is uh, Rex still alive in this run? He sure is. You know, I made I made sure of that. Email from Sergeant uh, Kavanaugh on Sergeant Elichi. Um Email from Sergeant. Da, da, da. Next time you want to warn me that the Geth are our friends and that maybe we're not supposed to shoot at the big robots. I almost pissed myself when these prime, uh, prime started dropping out of the sky and mop, uh, and mopping up the, the Reapers. Um, we fired a few rounds at them until we realized they weren't fighting back. Then this uh, one comes over and said uh, they're allied assistance and asked for our status. I'm not complaining. They saved my crew. Uh, I'm... Uh, but I'm never living down having to apologize to a Geth for shooting one of its damn lights off. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Ever since... Have accessed all these cool little emails ever since Liara became, you know, Mrs. WikiLeaks. <laughs> what is this? Uh, uh, improve Geth res uh, resistors. Uh... Oh, cool. Um, miniaturized armor capacitors. Uh, this data was discovered uh, and downloaded from the Geth Consensus. Thousands of these miniature uh, capacitors were install uh, installed uh, beside armor uh, uh, armor power cells, where they can instantly uh, discharge uh, a stored boost of energy. This boost can be tweaked either at speed up uh, shield generation. Uh, or at the rate at which tech, biotic, and, com and combat powers can be used. Cool. So I either get a shield bonus or a power cooldown bonus. Well, my power cooldown is pretty good as is. I'm going to go with a shield bonus. Yeah. And then Geth Resistors. Um, yeah. Uh, shield strength or power, power damage. Ooh. More shield strength or damage boost. Uh... I honestly don't think there's too much of an issue in terms of how much damage I'm outputting, so I'm going to go with more shield strength. Nice. And then... Garrus. Garrus, we'll talk to Garrus. Peace between the Geth and Corians. Who would have thought? Not how I ever imagined that would turn out. And next you'll be telling me the Krogan and Turians are cooperating. Oh, right. You managed that one too. You're a peacemaker, Shepard. A rare thing these days. Now, if you can pacify the Reapers, we'll make you a saint. <laughs> That's a thought. <laughs> Was it uh, FYI? Power damage boost doesn't affect uh, power combo explosions. Uh, yeah, yeah, that's uh, that's probably a good thing to know. Um, and I do use I do use those quite a bit. All right, so we'll go down to the lower levels and we'll get uh, we'll see how the rest of the crew uh, reacts to the uh, the Corian and and uh Corian and Geth peace treaty. Uh let's see. Let's see we got crew deck. Right, then we got these two levels. Okay, let's go. That was fun, but I'll have to pause it there. If you enjoy my content and want to see more, do some of the stuff that the screen is telling you and check out my other stuff. If you want to see me play live, check out the links in the description. Come talk to me, maybe even play with me. That is it for this episode and I will see you in the next game.